The A-Team Wreck Disneyland will not be seen at this time so that we may bring you this holiday special. Super special that turkey burgers. They're coming up. Wow. Do you think Burroughs getting a little carried away with these holiday special burgers? Yeah. I mean, for Easter, we had bunny burgers. Yeah. And on Thanksgiving, we're having turkey burgers. Yeah. Hey, anything's got to be better than his regular burgers, yeah. right? Yeah. Uh, I heard that, Christine, but you just wait until you try one of these succulent turkey burgers. I, I, I... <laughs> mm. Of course. 100% pure turkey. Yeah. <laughs> Not one, no. I always say. Dougie, what are you doing with that rabbit? Um, I'm waiting for it to lay some Easter eggs. <laughs> I don't believe this. Listen, Doug, I hate to break this to you, but bunnies don't lay eggs. Oh, yeah? Then what's this? This and this. Oh, wow. Let me see this rabbit. Be careful, Vanessa. Don't shoot me up, Rose. You might make the colors run. We eat wild duck. Every Thanksgiving, we eat wild turkey. Groundhog Day, we eat groundhog. I just uh, never took you on the hunt before. Oh, my God. Like this. Oh. Ah. Oh. Boy, boy, oh, boy. Just wait till you guys try my very, very special Bart's Holiday Burgers. Mm. What's a holiday, Bart? Groundhog Day. Uh, oh, oh, look, the burgers cast my shadow. Does that mean six more weeks of winter? Uh, 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 I heard that. Hi, and welcome to another episode of You Can't Do That on Television, the show that should probably take a holiday. As you probably guessed, this week's show is all about holidays, and not the kind of holidays that your parents take you on, because they always drag you off to the beach, but those holidays that we enjoy celebrating about once a month, like uh, Thanksgiving or the groundhog looking for a shadow. You know, Christine, or... when I looked at the production schedule and I saw holiday, I got all excited because I thought we were going to get a day off, not be stuck in here doing this show. Yeah, actually, you've got a really good point there, Lisa. It's about time there was some sort of holiday for actors yeah, like us. Yeah. Hey, Ross. Well, what do you want? We think that there should be a holiday for actors. Yeah. yeah. You're right, and I agree. Oh. And if I ever find any actors, I'll give them a holiday. Meanwhile, you guys got a show to do. Ross, yes. I don't think you understand. Uh, we were talking about us. We're yeah. actors. Yeah. <laughs> you kids, actors? Are you kidding? Actors are people who work under bright lights. Oh, what are those? And uh, actors are people who remember their lines. Uh, we remember our lines so sometimes. <laughs> and actors are people who uh, belong to a union. And they pay their union dues. And that reminds me. Well. You guys haven't paid your union dues lately. Oh, Come on. Uh, you're right, Bob. Come on. We're not at it. We're not going. Oh, no, no, we're just sort of wandering off. All right, yeah, hey, listen. Show. This is a yeah, grievance. We're not actors. <laughs> These kids have got to pay. Boy, the best. Holidays. Yeah, there's nothing to do except sit around and be lazy. Yeah, you know, kids, it's the only thing that hasn't changed since I was a kid. <laughs> Something else that hasn't changed is the help I get around here. Hey, Mother's Day is coming up real soon. Our uh, kids got a point there, about Maybe you should start baking your Mother's Day cake now. Vanessa, don't 
don't encourage your father. <laughs> oh, hi, Lucy. What are you doing? I'm making up a Christmas list for each of my friends. Oh, oh, Moose, have I told you what a good friend you are? Like, I mean, we've known each other for such a long time, and you do so much for me, and you're my best pal. Aww. And I hope you don't take me seriously when I say that stuff about your figure. Oh, I never take you seriously. It's good. Well, there's this pink sweater that I saw downtown, and it's just gorgeous. And, and if you would... No, that... No, 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 it's not a list of gifts that I'm going to give to my friends. It's a list of gifts that I want my friends to give me. Oh. And that's yours. Oh. And, you know, two or three things on... Oh, Dougie, hey! Oh, oh and Alice there as well. Great. That's your list? Thanks. And that's your list. <laughs> Dougie, whatever is the matter, dear? I just found out it's really Dad who's Santa Claus. No. <laughs> Do you know, I've always wondered why he keeps all those reindeer in the garage. <laughs> oh, kids, listen. You know, I love Thanksgiving. The turkey and the stuffing and the trimmings. <laughs> oh. Oh. What's that? It's a cucumber sandwich, Alistair. Yeah, but, uh, but uh, Allery, where, where's the turkey? Yeah, and the stuffing. Uh. Yeah, and the pumpkin pie. Oh, well, today's Thanksgiving, right? Uh -huh. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. And you had a holiday, Alistair. Yeah. And Lance, you had a holiday. Well, uh... And you had a holiday, too, Vanessa, right. didn't you? Yeah. Well, so did I. Oh. Well, hey, I hear that birth is a pretty good deal on Groundhog. Ground? Oh, hey, let's go. Yeah. Mm, nom, 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 nom. You know, I really feel sorry for that poor turkey. Why, Vanessa? Well, it gets picked on for weeks and weeks after Thanksgiving, and all year round, anybody who's stupid, we call a turkey. Oh, Lester, don't even listen to her. Come on, baby. Come on. Hey, Vanessa, what's up? You know, I think Lisa's dating a turkey. Someone else is new. <laughs> Oh, Alistair, you know, today is Thanksgiving. Oh, so what? I haven't got anything to give thanks for, chained up in this stupid dungeon all the time. You know, Gillis, you may be right. Uh, I was just going to give you the day off so you could have some turkey, but if you've got nothing to give thanks for, then there's no point. See you around. No, oh, hey, wait, wait. Are you thinking something to give thanks for? Forget it. Like these chains, they give me great posture. Uh, the dentist down here keeps throat and tongue muscles in superb Dad, it was really great of you to volunteer to play the Easter Bunny in the Easter egg hunt, but uh, don't you think you ran into the wrong bunny suit? Uh, what do you mean, Vanessa? Oh, oh, is my tail on crooked? <laughs> uh, not exactly. Well, what? <laughs> oh, Alistair, what are you going to give up for Lent? Uh, liver, lima beans, oysters, piano lessons, classical music, detentions, and homework. <laughs> Alistair, those are really easy things to give up. You're supposed to give up things that you really like. Well, those are the things I really like, miss. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but could this be the introduction to the opposites? <laughs> What's the matter, Dougie? Why didn't you tell me about Dad being Santa Claus? <laughs> we didn't want to spoil Christmas for you, dear. Wait till the other kids find out. <laughs> What's the matter with our little elf, our little uh, boy, Mother Claus? He's upset to find out that you're really Santa Claus and not just some <laughs> regular father pretending. Oh, 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 oh. Boy, what a disappointment. Oh, no, Dougie. You'd better watch out. You'd better not cry. You'd better not cry. I'm telling you why. Oh, Shut, Dad, up. Shut up. Oh, yeah. And uh, thanks again, Doc, for coming over and putting this band on my knee. I think nothing of it, my boy. After all, it was a holiday and I had nothing else to do. By the way, if you happen to scrape the other knee or anything else, just phone me at my office, and if I'm not in my office, phone the golf course, and I'll come right over. Sure. Uh, here. Uh, uh, no, 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 no fee. I mean it being a holiday and all. Okay, thanks a lot. All right. I've seen a lot of office sketches, but this is the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard. I hate holidays, don't you, Vanessa? Yeah, there's nothing to do except go to the movies, hang out at the arcades, or go to the beach. Other boring things like that. Yeah. Oh, there you are. Uh, children, would one of you go to the store for me, please? Oh, I will, Mom, please. Oh, oh you know, I'm going. You oh, went last. No, I did. Oh, you did. Oh, you went last. No. Okay, so, uh, 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 so,
Hey, hey, kids. Honey. Kids. No. I've been thinking, you know, because this show is about holidays, and you kids have been working on your holiday, kind of, I think you should get extra pay. Oh, oh no. that's not no. necessary, no. boss. No, no, really. Working on this show is just like being on holiday. Oh, yeah. And uh, we should pay just to be here. Yeah. Oh, exactly. Well, I can't I quarrel have... with that. I think you should pay. So, pay up. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Hmm? Ross, this is an opposite skit, remember? Yeah. You're not supposed to agree. Yeah. Not anymore. <laughs> the opposites are over. Hey, oh, Alice, you idiot. You're right there, you blew it. You know, as if, as if we want to pay to be on the show. Oh, oh, oh come on. <laughs> I've done it, Lisa. I have finally figured it out. Done what? Well, you see, Lisa, if I change my religion 87 times and add on those religious holidays to the public holidays, that makes 365 days exactly. And I won't have to go to school anymore. <laughs> but, Alistair, think of all the time you're going to be spending in church. Yeah. And synagogues and temples and mosques. Okay, all right, I get it. That seemed like a good idea at the time. <laughs> oh, Mom, that was the best Thanksgiving dinner. Oh, well, thank you, Lisa. Mm -hmm. I certainly am thankful that Thanksgiving is over for this year, though. It just takes so long to prepare. Well, how long does it take to stuff a turkey? Well, that all depends on what kind of turkey you mean, Lisa. <laughs> Lisa, don't encourage your mother. Uh, Christine? Hmm? What is the big holiday in April that we celebrate what used to be the Roman New Year? I don't... Ah, uh, you almost caught me. Forget it, Ross. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Seeing as the show is about holidays, you get a holiday from being slimed. No slime? No <laughs> slime. <laughs> okay, Ross, what was that question again? What is the big holiday in April that we celebrate what used to be the Roman New Year? I don't know. <laughs> what is it? Uh, April Fool's Day. <laughs> I would ask the least, sir. Uh... Hey, Barbie, what's the same class? Burger. You got it. That's it. Just a, a little remembrance of the saint who drove all the snakes out of Ireland. Oh, you don't mean you made the burgers with snake meat, do you? Oh, well, no. You think I would do a thing like that? Barbie, the hamburger's green. Of course it's green. I've been letting it rot for weeks now, so it'd be nice and green for St. Patty's Day. Hold it. Don't nobody move. I think I might have seen it wriggle. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I guess I... Yeah, just a little rattler for... for uh, here you go, Lisa. It's for Valentine's Day. Oh, Esther. Thank you. Oh. Um, Esther, I don't want to seem ungrateful or anything like that, but there's only one piece of candy in here. What happened to the rest? Well, I ate them. Well, the see, Lisa, I like you. I like you a lot, but not a whole box worth. Let's see how much you like this. I hate soft centers. <laughs> Dougie, um, why are you carrying that club? It's my Christmas club. I could be wrong, but I thought a Christmas club was when you put money in the bank until Christmas so that you could get what you wanted when Christmas came. Well, you see, this is sort of the same thing, but if Santa Claus doesn't bring me what I want, he's going to get close. <laughs> Good idea. Oh, 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 Alistair, how many times do I have to talk to you about dragging your things through the house? Young man, if you keep this up, Santa Claus isn't going to bring you any presents for Christmas this year. Mom, who do you think I've got in this sack? Alistair, you can't bring Santa Claus home. Who's going to bring presents to all the other little boys and girls? Oh, don't worry about it, Mom. Uh, Main Street's full of hundreds of other Santas ringing bells. I'll just stick one. Oh. Hey, Vanessa? Yeah, Daddy? Why do we call Thanksgiving Thanksgiving? 
Because we give thanks for the bountiful harvest. Why do we call it Labor Day? Because we celebrate the working person. Why do we call it Good Friday? Because we get a day off school, and that's good. Oh, yeah, right. Hey, Lisa. Yeah, Alistair. What's your favorite holiday? Ah, oh, Christmas time, because you get lots of presents. Oh, yeah, that's pretty good, but my favorite holiday is the summer holiday. Why? Because it's the longest. <laughs> hey, Lou. Yeah, Vanessa? You know, my favorite holiday is my birthday. Vanessa, that's not exactly a holiday. We don't all celebrate your birthday. Yes, we do. My birthday's on July 4th. She's got a point there, Lucy. Don't encourage her. Hey, Lisa. Yeah, Vicky. Did you know there was a holiday named after you? After me? Lisa Day. Oh. No, Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving? Yeah. Well, see, around my house, they call it Turkey Day. And you're a I get it. I get it. Hey, Moose. Yeah, Alistair. What's your favorite holiday? Valentine's Day. Ooh, Valentine's Day. Do you get lots of chocolates? Well, no, but every Valentine's Day, I give Lisa a big heart-shaped box of chocolates with creamy centers. And... <laughs> yeah, and then what? Well, then I watch her squirm when I tell her she's on a diet. She can't eat any. <laughs> Ooh, no. What's smart? I know, I know. <laughs> hey, Ross. Hmm? What's the handkerchief for? Oh, well, I got to thinking, you know, uh, Christmas uh, and all the holidays have their own symbols, like Christmas tree, and Easter has a, uh, a egg, and there's all kinds of things like uh, turkeys and uh, pumpkins and ghosts. And yeah, stuff. but Ross, what holiday has a handkerchief as its symbol? Income tax day. <laughs> Income tax day is no holiday. You're telling me. Oh. <laughs> Ready, aim. Oh, wait a minute. What is it now? Well, today's Veterans Day, and you can't expect your uh, firing squad to work today. It'd be unpatriotic. <sighs> oh, you're right. Okay, amigo, I should go home. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Oh, okay. oh, Adios. That was the only right thing to do, but uh, don't I get a day off, too? Oh, why, sure. Of course, you're right. The way you go. Have a good holiday. <laughs> See you tomorrow. Right. <laughs> Okay, Alistair, here are your chores for today. I want you to take out the trash. I want you to deflee uh, the dog. You can wash and wax my car while you're out there. Mow the lawn, and then you come back and clean up your room. Oh, and by the way, I want you to polish my bowling ball. But, Dad, today's a holiday. It's Labor Day. That's right. And that's why you are going to labor. Okay. Uh, Today is homework holiday. Oh, sir? Mm, yes, Lisa. Um, how do we celebrate this holiday? By staying right here and doing it after school. <laughs> gotcha. Now, kiddos, today you get our three-for-one holiday special. Oh, yeah? You only give me three quarters for my one dollar. Oh, yeah, that's right. It's your three-for-one holiday special. It's more like a holiday rip-off. What's so special about it? It's specially to pay for my holiday trip to Disneyland. I always knew this was a Mickey Nose operation. <laughs> All right, yo, listen up. Because of the holiday, I will not be on the road tomorrow. What holiday is that? Busman's holiday. That's not a holiday. Busman's holiday means you do on your day off what you usually do when you were working. It, it does? Yeah, but it doesn't matter in your case because you're hardly ever on the road. <laughs> hey, Dad, that's a really nice tie you got for Easter. Oh, what makes you uh, think it's my Easter tie, Alistair? Well, it's got egg all over it. <laughs> what do you mean? Look at here. All my ties have got egg all over them. Your father didn't point there, Alistair. Ugh. Don't encourage him, Mom. Guys, <laughs> Will someone please tell me the true meaning of Memorial Day? Oh, sir! Alistair. It means we get a day off. <laughs> yeah. No, 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 no. That is not the true importance of the day. Well, it is to me. Don't you like holidays for the same reason? Me? Well, wait a minute, Alistair. You mean 
I don't have to come to school on holidays either? Right. Hold it. Just a moment. You mean that all those years, year after year, I've been sitting here on holidays doing absolutely nothing while you guys were out having fun and I didn't have to? Right. Oh, my. I, I, I've got to see the principal. <laughs> Chick treat, chick treat. Dougie, this isn't Halloween. I know that, Miss, but I thought since the show is about holidays, this would be a perfect chance for me to get some extra trick or treating in this year. So, trick or treat, trick or treat. Okay. Here. Wait a minute. What is this? This is just a plain glass of water. Well, who said anything about a treat? <laughs> Oh. oh, Mom, you're really exhausted. I am, Alistair. I've just spent two hours dressing the turkey. Oh. But, Mom, doesn't Dad know how to dress himself yet? <laughs> Don't encourage your mother. Should all the acquaintance be forgot and never brought to What are you celebrating? Chinese New Year. But you know, there's only one problem. What's that? We well, see, just like Chinese food, two hours after you celebrate, you want to celebrate again. <laughs> what are you writing? My New Year's resolution. Can I look at it? Okay. Oh, thank you. <clears throat> I, Lisa Ruddy, resolve to one, lose 10 pounds, <laughs> two, Stop gossiping? <laughs> right. Three, do my homework every night. <laughs> Four, stop kidding Christine about her figure. Now that is a good start, Lisa. And I bet you won't stick to them. Oh, well, it doesn't really matter. I plan to give them up for Lent anyway. <laughs> What's the matter, Dad? Oh. Alistair, I drank too much again at last night's New Year's Eve party. Oh. Hangover, huh? Oh, oh yes, yes, don't do that. Oh. I've made a New Year's resolution, Alistair. I'm not going to drink nearly as much at next New Year's Eve party. Dad, you make that same resolution every year. I know that, Alistair. Nobody's expected to keep a New Year's resolution, at least not for a whole year. Well, that just about wraps up another episode of You Can't Do That on Television. Thank goodness. You know, with all this talk about holidays, I still think that we should get some sort of holiday, you know? Yeah. 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 Holiday. Hey, kids, yeah. kids, Christine, I have heard your plea, and I have decided that you can all take tomorrow up. Take tomorrow off and stop being actors for the day and just be normal kids again. Oh, yeah, normal, normal, normal kids again and go to school. Uh, well, then again, Ross, I mean, let's not be hasty. Now that I think about it, oh, it's a dumb idea, you know? I think it's a dumb idea. What? I mean, you never heard of it. That on television has been a Thanksgiving production. I don't know about you, but I'm just giving thanks that it's over. <laughs> you know, that wasn't a very nice thing you said, Vanessa. I know, and I'm sorry. I guess I'm just a little outspoken. Outspoken? Not by anyone I know. Look, I promise not to say a thing for the rest of the show. Hey, Ross! Ross, get this! Did you hear that? We're gonna get a holiday from Ruddy's mouth. She just promised not to say another word for the rest of the show. <laughs> Some holiday. This is the last bit in the show. <laughs> <laughs>